Hello and welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to go and do a video in Ballybeg Priory. This is a really old priory here in um, North Cork area and as we can see the priory dedicated to St Thomas was founded in 1229 by Philip de Barry from the Canons Regular of St Augustine priests who lived accordingly to the Mon monastic rule the prior the priory building was laid out in the 13th century around a central cluster of courtyard on a north side was a long rectangular church now ruined so what i'll do is i'll take a screenshot of this i'll just uh, i'll hold this for a second and then you can pause and read it so let's have a look i've never been here myself so it's interesting looking place here it is but if it's rain stops, I'll get the drone out and be, be able to get into places where you wouldn't normally be able to get in. But um, it's walled off the whole area and it looks really, really, really cool looking. Unfortunately, there's gates in it. And unfortunately, these gates are locked. Well, this one here is anyway. So let's go and have a look, see can we get into any of them. Let's go in. See if you can maybe get a look in there. Mm. Yeah. Unfortunately, we can't get into this one, which is really sad that we can't because. Just a lovely looking old building. Imagine this place was built in the 13th century. Apart from that wall there, obviously it was repaired. <clears throat> much, much later on. And of course it would be locked, but we can get in over there, look. Ah. So let's have a look and see this old building. Has been repaired in a few places. You see the scaffold is here. So they're maintaining what's left of it like. And if I look at the ground, you can see the footprints of the cows. Cows or sheep or something. So there is animals grazing here. I suppose there's no harm because it keeps the grass down. But on the other hand, it muck, muckies the place up. Wow, look at that. Look how cool that is. Keystone up there. That's the keystone holding it all up. Remove that stone. That one there in the middle of the screen right now. Remove that. And the whole lot would fall. So you can see here where the holes in the wall were. I would have thought maybe it was Joyce or something in them, but would say in that it'd be very small floors if that was the case. But whoever, let's go in here and have a look. See, you can climb through here, which is cool. And wow, look at the old stone walk. It's just amazing how these places were built. Too close. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful place. Absolutely lovely. As you can see, there's a stairwell here as well. And of course, it's locked off. And we have no access to it, unfortunately. But I will take the drone up if it stops raining. Look at the stone walk on that house there. Look at that. And that's a lovely, lovely to have in a building. You can see the area on here as well. The columns from these windows here. This priory was just amazing. And the, the workmen, the craftsmanship that went into these buildings were to be built like the 13th century, the 1200s, like. 
you know? You have to give credit for the credit's true. People who build these things, they really built them sturdily. Another lovely arch. Absolutely gorgeous. And this has got two keystones. One here and one here. It's very mucky. We have a dandelion. Mm. Dandelions are... You can eat these. Like I'm going to do now. And what are extremely good for is anti-inflammatory. So the last stairs we looked at would have would have come here into there. So what I'll do is I get the drone up and then we'll get nice high definition pictures there now in a second. But um, as we garden the round tower I can't get over to that. Can I? Because we see we've we've got some beautiful horses in there. I thought it was cows but it's really horses. So what we'll do is we get a drone and we go over and we have a look at the round tower as well and we can have a look in these areas here and these areas, this area over here, this one and this one and see what it's like with the stairwell. So this is the monitor here. Um, lovely, very, very, very nice rune that's left of it. I would imagine it would have been destroyed when the British or the Normans come in, that would have been about the time when the Normans and the Ireland. Um, with that persecution of the British persecuted a lot of people in um, religious persecution from the Cromwell and the like of that. I don't know when this was destroyed, but I didn't read the flag. I imagine something like that, but um. Let's get the drone up and have a look and we'll see what that one is over there too. Because uh, I don't know what it is. So, drone time. Please enjoy, hit the subscribe button, give it a like and enjoy.
this over here at this round tower we had a, a little look with the drone <clears throat> it's a bit messy coming in here with the horses but hey we don't know wow let's look at this I need to zoom in there now look how cool this is This is just amazing. That's a stone mug. How beautiful. The Celtic people and the buildings that we've built here in Ireland. Amazing. This is so beautiful. There is a stairwell, as I say, but I don't think I can get into it. But let's go and see. Is it possible? around here. I don't think it is. No. No. It's not, but this is a really, really, really beautiful place. Absolutely, I'm going to get photographed in here now. Before I leave.